All right, I'm doing my last video. This is a warning. Okay, I'm gonna go over this. I'm gonna go over this once. Yes, yes. I am marked. This is my mark. That's my mark. That is Christ. That is my mark. I'm marked. I know some things that I need to tell y'all. I'm gonna get right into it. Try not, I'm gonna try and keep it as short as I can, but um, I'm seeing, I'm sensing something big happening in September and October. In September and October, late September and early October, Christ was born. So that's when Christ was really born. We were all deceived on the churches saying December 25th was his birthday. It's all deceit, baby. You gotta get this through your head. I know my stuff, so I'm gonna go right into this. Um, September and October was when Christ was born. So with that said, this is the time back then. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna take this the whole way back then to a few months ago. Shut down everything. Sports, work, everything. Quarantine yourself. There's a reason. Reason was we pen. God wanted your attention. I'm gonna say this to every single viewer I get on here. Okay, this is a warning. Okay, get right with God now. I'm telling you this for your own well-being and your soul and your spirit. You need to know this. I'm going to put this out there. I know some things people don't know. I can sense it. I have a good sense that something catastrophic is going to happen between September and October. So, be prepared. No one's going to believe me on this until it's too late. I'm just saying this now so you repent and you can be on good gracious with him before either a rapture happens or a comet hits or it could, anything catastrophic. A war, huge war breaks out. Like anything's possible right now, but it's supposed to happen. So with that said, with everything being shut down, that was God's doing saying, you know what? I don't want you paying attention to anything but me. That was him. He did it for a reason. So it gives you time to be saved. I'm gonna put this out there. All right. Yes, my wisdom is a lot better than what it was years ago. Thank you, Rodney Cunningham, that actually made me see the big, huge picture of this world. This world's crazy. We see people shooting in the street. We see people killing each other. We see, we're going to start seeing war. Now we're at a war with this virus. Think about it. This evil is showing itself. Pedophilia, California, legal. Really? Really? Legalizing sin. Drugs are going to become legal next. Then we're going to get a chip next year. If you make it through, what's going to happen? You're going to be get a chip in you that can buy and sell stuff. Mark of the beast. I'm telling you all this now so I can save you. Get your mentality right. Because when the time comes, it's going to be very hard and it's going to be very scary and you're just going to give in. Have your mentality like this. All right, this is what I do. I try to get scared. I breathe. I say God got my back. If he is for me, who can stand against me? This evil cannot defeat you. This is flesh. Get this through your head. This is your flesh against your spirit. Spirit's inside you. Fighting this flesh of the sin. So God, Jesus, died on that cross just as we're supposed to die for him. So if it comes down to don't be scared of dying because after life you know what it's a lot better it's a lot sweeter it feels a lot better when you're with him that feeling is 10 times better than any feeling on this earth this earth ain't nothing this is just how can I put this this is just temporary this is temporary this isn't forever so with that said I'm speaking from my spirit because my spirit's out right now and it just wants to let everyone know. Speaking in a different way, it just it feels really weird. Just knowing some things makes it really weird. Because this election, this presidential stuff, you could blame anything on Trump. You could blame anything on Biden. But you know what? It's evil. Everything's evil. We look at the world. So messed up right now. Everything's all happening at once. We see a big, huge change into a new world order that's going to have one government. 
And that government's going to say, they'll tell you when you can have your money, how much money you get. It's called crypto, it's a cryptocurrency is what it's called. And they wanted to say 666 on it, but, you know, that's the mark of the beast. If you do the corona thing, write down corona. Point out every single letter. How many letters is it? C would be three. O would be, you know, how many letters? Count them. Add it up. 666. Corona. So, you could say it's a mark of the beast, but it's not the mark of the beast until there's an actual chip or there's something inserted in you. There's a lot to this I can really get into, but for now, I just want to say, bless y'all. I love y'all. Get right, pray, and have a relationship. That's all I'm going to say. I'm going to leave it at that. He gave you time. When you're a quarantine, they shut down sports. They shut down every single thing. To be quarantined so you can focus. God bless y'all. Have a good day. I'm going to go spend it with my son. Stay up.